Hi foodies, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a, another taste test. Um, this was from Lidl's again, I believe. And it's from their deluxe range and it's a beef ragu topped with a grana padano cheese. Now, original price was three euros and 99 cent and I got it for one euro 99 cent whoops I got that the wrong way around so I'm going to put this in my microwave because you can't see what it looks like and whilst we're doing that we'll go over what's in it so now that's in the microwave so this is Succulent cooked beef in Northern Irish ragu sauce on a bed of con oh, congee, congee, I can't say the woody word, pasta and topped with granana, granat, grana, padiano cheese and I butchered every single word there, sorry, but you can see it there. Now, unfortunately, half the um, ingredients is missing. That's the way I got the box. But there's your nutrition facts there. And as you can see, I got it from Lidl's. And it's a 400 gram box. And it says 100% Irish beef. So when this is cooked, I'll bring you back for the taste test. So the ragu is done, so I'm going to give you a closer look. So this smells absolutely delicious, it smells rich, so I've noticed there's one, two, three pieces of beef in this, which doesn't surprise me at all with not ready meals. So we're going to try the pasta with some of this sauce let's try some of that sauce on it It's a little tomatoey. It's also a beefy sauce. No law found another piece of beef. Now these are the size of the beef. melt in the mouth really really tender carrot carrot's too mushy for my liking we try another now don't get me wrong this is really nice, it's rich in flavour, it's got plenty of um, seasoning. Beef is tender, there's no horrible bristly bits. As I said, I know there's only a, a small few pieces, but you get what you pay for, I suppose. 
But saying that, if you were paying four euro, you'd expect a little bit more. Um, as usual with these um, frozen pasta dishes, the texture of the shells are very soft. Now that's okay for a lot of people. I like mine with a bit more chew. I like mine al dente. But don't get me wrong, as I said, it is a nice dish. It is flavorful. Very, very rich in flavor. I'd get it again if it was on sale. I wouldn't pay a full price for it purely because there's too little meat in it. I mean, you don't have to put a gazillions of meat in, in a dish. But three or four pieces, no. But what this there of them tastes very, very, very nice. Very flavorful. So, yeah, that's the beef ragu. Did I taste any cheese? The answer is no. I don't taste any cheese whatsoever. As I said, the sauce is a tomato beef flavour, but it's more beefy than tomato, You can, if you understand what I mean. But yeah, I'd give that a solid six and a half, seven. So if you see it on sale, you see it on a sticker, then yeah, I'd recommend that. So that's all for this one. So I hope you enjoyed the content. Um, tomorrow will be Hungarian Day. So I hope you look forward to that. Yeah, so um, like, subscribe, comment, click the notification bell for new uploads. Thanks for watching, foodies. Goodbye.